Hi, Gran. Oh, hi, lovey. The thighs on him, he could crack walnuts. Oh. I'm going to tell you you said that. <laughs> Don't mind us, I've got two shifts on at the Rovers. Just, well, Liz and Steve. Uh-oh. Craig. Yeah? you got a minute? It's about Bethany. She's all right? Yeah, she's much better, thanks to you. Me she said that you'd spoken to her about how well she's doing. So, a table for six has just become a table for none. OK, so then let's talk about damage limitation. Fine. I'm all ears. Well, oh, no. do you know what? I think I better leave before I say something we both regret. <sighs> we just had another cancellation. Oh, well, probably just as well, seeing how the chef... Please. Thank you, and thank you for doing it so quickly. You're welcome. Any time. Maybe you'd like to stay for lunch? I thought there was no such thing as a free lunch. <laughs> All right, eating in Crimea Street. Oh, the glamour. <laughs> See ya. Bye. Only two booked in for lunch. <sighs> I know. But no head chef. And Zidane can cope, but... I was ready to come home, and then... I don't know, this bloke just... whacked me from behind. He took my phone and my wallet. Ah. Someone called the cops, and... Well, I... I was a bit drunk, so they, uh... They took me in and kept me overnight. How drunk? Well, if you're expecting me to feel sorry for you. Michelle. Look, I let you down. And I hate myself for that. Because you're the most important person in my life. You're right, I, I let the stress get to me. Yeah, well, it's not just you it's affecting, is it? It's the business and all. Yeah, I know, but we can turn this around. You know, we put more ads in the papers, we, we do more of those special weeks. I'm good at those. We'll see if... <coughs> Oi! <gasps> Coronation Street continues in half an hour. Turn around and attach you. Why would someone do something like this in broad daylight? Could be a message. What message? Well, this isn't the first piece of vandalism we've to burn the place down. Hey, I am not going to let him terrorise us. Really? You weren't here last night. You just ran after that bloke and left me on my own. If the police can't stop... <gasps> Stay there. Robert, no! Call the police now. anything, leave it, let the police see what he's done. How did he get in here? I don't know. You've got some nice friends you have. He's no friend of mine. This is our home. He broke into our home. I can't see anything's been taken. No, exactly. He doesn't want to steal from us. He just wants to frighten us and it's working because I'm scared stiff. Hey. Of course he will. It's what he's good at, isn't it? Bistro and now this. It's OK. <sighs> Police will catch him. You reckon? If he can do this, what's he going to do next? <laughs> 